Okay, now I'm going to start with uh, palpations of certain structures. So I'm going to start with the posterior tibialis tendon, which comes on the posterior part of the medial malleolus, right here. Good, Melissa, go ahead and hover it good and back down. And you can really see it come through. It runs alongside the medial malleolus posteriorly and inferiorly. Um, so I'm going to do the sinus tarsi, which is going to be on the lateral side, inferior of the lateral malleolus, right here, basically the opposite of the uh, sustenaculum talli. Um, then I have the deltoid ligament. Again, it's going to be on the inside right here. So it's going to be inferior of malleo the medial malleolus. It's going to connect, con uh, the complex is going to connect to the talus, the navicula, and the calcaneus. Um, and then I have the anterior talofibular, uh, talofibular ligament, which is going to be anterior of the lateral malleolus right here. Yeah, if you rub along it, you can really feel like the, the cords of it very lightly. And then last but not least, I have the dorsal pedis pulp where you can find the pulse of an individual. And um, so this is going to be on the anterior midfoot. And I like to find the navicular bone right here and then run alongside um, la uh, uh, su su uh, let's see. Meet, uh, laterally and superiorly, you should be able to feel right there. Should be able to feel her pulse. Okay, so now I'm going to go into taking a manual muscle test of her metat uh, metatarsal phalanges for extension. So now you can uh, scoot back just a little bit. Okay, so first, Melissa, go ahead and bring your toes up to you like this. Good, and relax. Okay, so I'm checking if she can do it actively first, if she can do the fair test one more time. Good, and relax. Okay. So we're going to do the same thing where I'm going to, uh, you're going to bring your toes up like this. Hold your toes up. Okay, don't let me push down. Hold. Hold, hold. Okay, so she did break. Uh, so I would give her like a three plus out of five. So now she's going to, uh, four out of five, sorry. Okay, now we're gonna do it only with your big toe, okay? So go ahead, bring your toe up and down. Up one more time and down. Good, okay, so now we're gonna hold it here. Don't let me come down. Hold, hold. Hold. Okay, she definitely broke. <laughs> okay, so I would give her a three plus. It was a little bit weaker than the the entire uh, complex. So when I was doing the first metatars MTP extension, we were testing the house longus, and when I was doing the entire MTPs, we were doing the extensor digitorum. Um, so now we're going to do plantar flexion and non weight bearing. Melissa, go ahead and flip onto your back. I mean, your stomach. You can back up a little bit. And legs off. So I'm going to do it with her uh, right leg. All right, good. Melissa, go ahead. Go ahead and bring your toes out like this. One more time. Good, okay. So I'm going, so hold this position right here. Don't let me push you down. Hold. Hold, hold, okay, very good. So that was testing all the gastric right there. That was a five out of five. Go ahead, bend your knee. Go ahead, bring your uh, bring your toes up to the ceiling one more time. Good, relax. And one more time. Good, hold this position. Hold, hold, hold. Good, okay. So that was pretty good. I gave her like a four out of five for her soleus, but her gastric was really good. Um, now you're gonna go ahead and stand up. Um, you can come off the table right here. Oh, leave your phone behind. <laughs> so now you're gonna get her get her feet. So you're gonna face the table. Okay. You can put your hands on the table if you need to for balance, but you can't 
use your put your whole entire body on the table, okay? Okay. All right. So what we're going to do, you're going to stand on one leg. Let's put your hands on the table. You're going to need it. Okay. Keep your knees straight. I want you to go up on your toes as many times as you can. <laughs> Three, four, five. Good. Okay. Great. Now you can bring your leg down. So now I'm going to show you how to test where the sole is. So you're going to do the same thing, but slight bend in the leg that you're standing in. Okay. Slight bend. Good. Now go ahead up. One. As high as you can go. Come on. Three. Four. And five. Good job. Okay. Yay. That's a five out of five. Yay. Okay. So that goes, that's, that's it. <laughs> that's it for the testing.